So yeah. let, let's dial it up. I'm gonna have too much fun with this. So let's go to age 76. Really? Oh no! <laughs> oh no! That's what I'm gonna look like, people. I'm gonna look like Doc from Back to the Future. Oh my God. Three, four. Hey guys, it's Patrick Freeman here in Chongqing, China. I am here with my friend Vivi from I Chongqing. Yeah, Vivi. She's the last time I saw you has been maybe the Hot Pot Festival. Hot Pot, yeah, Hot Pot Festival. Yeah, that last was, year. That was last. I think that was last year. <laughs> yeah, last year. So we actually, uh, I've known Vivi since I kind of arrived when I started filming. Uh, I did one of my first episodes at the zoo, and they invited me to go out there to do a. Uh, an episode, and it was a really cool episode because uh, we got to see the oldest living panda in captivity, yeah, yeah. Uh, Sing Sing. Is that right? Xing, yeah, Sing Sing. Yeah, Sing Sing. Is, is she still? New star. Yeah, yeah, new star. They invited me to come up here and uh, check out this technology expo, uh, the Smart China Smart Expo. China expo, expo online. online. Online, online. Because this year it's not open to the public. Okay. It's okay. just only open to the public online. And that's because of the virus, right? Yeah. Okay. So here we got a list of the different companies that are participating in the Smart China Expo. You got China General, Intelligent Connected Technology, Huawei Technology, Huawei, Changgang, Kawasaki. What if they have some high-tech motorcycles? You got Medical, Hold Hope, HKC, so guys, what I'm doing, I, I'm actually, uh, we're at a little model factory where they will actually build a refrigerator for you, but it's got a uh, integrated system that allows you to input the color of refrigerator that you want and uh, the different bells and whistles that you want to put on the refrigerator. So interactive, I should say. So this is the body, white, blue, pink. Let's do blue. Yeah. So we got a blue. Door, this is a door. Door. Blue door and then blue. I want blue everything. Okay. everything. All right, blue everything. So check, hit the check mark. Yes. Okay. 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 Yes. That's fine. Oh. Oh, okay. Now I got to do my signature. Okay. Take a picture. Okay. 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 Oh. Print. We want to. Yes. All right. Did my picture. Okay. Is it cool? Put it in the shopping cart. Yes. And now you can see. Okay. There we go. My refrigerator, my Ken and Barbie refrigerator, is being built. It's a little glitch. They can't make them bigger than Ken and Barbie. I'm kidding. This is just a uh, a model factory. But it's all cool that it's got all the robots. <laughs> Technology can identify people's face in different ages. So I'm getting my picture here. Yes. And this is year 10, this is year 80. You can check your face. And this is when you are 21. This oh. is when? Yeah. When you're 21, oh, it's, it's just change your face, oh. your age. Let's keep it at 21. I, I How about 18? Uh, it even takes the gray out of my beard. Look at that. So 18, let's look at when I was five. five. No, 10. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this kind of technology can help the police find the missing people. Wow. Yeah, like they are, um, they, uh, are missed and they're third, um, three years old, and they can be fine in their 20s. Wow. Yeah. All right, so I'm standing here at this monitor. It's got a camera, and it takes a picture of you, and I'm age 51, and you can dial it all the way down to age, I guess 10 is where it stops, but it shows you what I look like at age 10 with kind of a little beard. 
Let's go up a little bit. Oh, this technology is used, used to find the lost children. The lost children. So it's a technology yeah, used the, to find lost. For example, when the child when the child was lost, uh, when uh, he's twelve, uh -huh. another ten years, and this technology can help it to find his parents. Wow, that's and amazing. The, uh, of yeah. The face. So yeah. let's dial it up. I'm going to have too much fun with this. So let's go to age seventy-six. Really? Oh no! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> That's what I'm gonna look like, people. I'm gonna look like Doc from Back to the Future. Oh my no, God! You're still very oh, she that very nice. Yeah, she is. Yeah. <laughs> let's go to. Let's go a little bit higher. Uh, 80s the highest. That is scary. Oh my God. Ah, oh uh, give me my depends. Where are my prunes? Damn it. Let's dial it. Let's go down to 29. <laughs> Wow, my nose is big in so that, that one. You when well, you well, well, that beats a henda. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about? My nose is big. Look, this is a technology, which is a great technology yeah, that you can find find lost, children. find lost children. Is this is this working now? I mean, is it in yeah, use? Yeah, yeah. yeah. It the case. Wow. Do you know how many children? Oh, yeah. Do well, you know how many children have been found? Uh, you can? But many. <laughs> oh, many. Good. So it's being used now to find uh, children that maybe have been kidnapped or they've run away from home. Yeah. 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 And so do you integrate this system with a camera system that can identify that child if they're a thousand miles away from home? Yeah. Does that make sense? Yeah. 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 Wow. Because of the network. Because of the network. It's okay. network in China. So you could have a child in... Beijing, yeah. and the camera has a picture of them, or this, this technology has a picture of them, it could actually find, it could recognize that child that's been kidnapped or lost, even if they're a thousand miles away, yeah. notify the authorities, and then they could come in and... Yeah, if their yeah. picture are uh, online, uh -huh. they can... Yeah. Wow. For example, because if, uh, if I lost my child, my, my daughter, in Beijing, uh -huh. and I call the police, Police. The police? Yeah, and then I come back to Chongqing, and the police will find my children, even if I'm in, in Chongqing or my, my, my daughter wow. is in Chengdu or something. Because wow. this one is it's a network in China. Okay. Wow, that is, that's, a, that's an awesome technology. Fun to play with, too. Automatic driving? Yeah. All right. This is the uh, uh, JR technology on the windows. Okay. Yeah. You can try it. All right, so we're going to go in. Looks, it, it reminds me of the uh, a space shuttle from the uh, from Star Trek, huh? Doesn't it look good? You can drive it. I can drive it. Uh, yeah. All right, hold on, just. A second. Wow. So now we're going to the airport. It's seventy miles an hour. Now we're going the max. Now that's how I like to drive right there. That's how. Yeah. That's how. That's how VV drives. In the future, there are more. There will be more information like the the shopping mall around the the where you driving. Okay. The shopping mall and the hotels or something like that. So this, this would be like an example of an automated car where you're not driving. You just tell the car where you want to go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow, wow. So how many locations in this example can you... Can, three. Just only three roads. Only three roads. Yeah, like I was saying earlier, I feel like I'm in a, uh, a shuttle on the Star, Star Trek Enterprise. Or maybe Deep Space Nine. Where's, where's Quark's bar when you need it? That's what I'm looking for. For all you Trekkies who know who Quark is. Smart Education Online Sensory Class. Okay. Let me see what this is. So what would this be used for? Um, if you are 
the system can make you immerse into a poem, uh, so you can learn the poem better and understand it better. Uh, you can do different actions in order to, uh, like, uh, direct it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, like uh, this. This means uh, zooming out. This means zooming in. And this means uh, turning left. And this means turning right. Okay. Yeah. So you might you might have a poem but you'll have a video behind it of maybe some yeah. scenery and if you want to explore the scenery yeah. you make these gestures and it'll allow you to navigate through it. Yeah. Okay, good. And, and you can also use this system to take other courses like uh, math uh, and uh, biology so you can uh, go into a cell to say to, to say the con consistence oh, wow. Wow. of the, the cell. So there are also uh, the line to uh, represent your uh, concentration in the courses yeah so it's um, kind of like a virtual teacher yeah does it shock you if you're not paying attention yeah it, <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> ow okay I'm, I'm paying attention now yeah. all right all right yeah. Uh, yeah. after the whole course there will be a score uh, like show your uh, actions uh, during the whole classes yeah wow very cool so uh, during this time uh, you know the coronavirus. Uh, many many students are taking the online course, and they may sleep mm -hmm. yeah. and do other things uh -huh. during the classes. However, uh, when I use this system, uh, even though uh, they uh, don't uh, maybe turn uh, turn on the uh, video, the teacher cannot see them, but uh, they're. Uh, action during the classes can also be referenced through this. Uh, wow, oh wow, talk about monitoring. Oh my God. Very cool. Thank you very much. Your English is good. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm studying uh, in UCSB. Oh, good. And, yeah. Are you studying English? Oh, uh, no. My major is economic and statistics. And now I'm just taking the online course uh, at home. Oh, yeah. very good. Yeah. Very good. We'll well, best of, best of luck to you. Best wishes. <laughs> Thank you All so right. much. Thank you for explaining. You. Appreciate it. Nice Say bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye. Yeah. Now, that was cool. Cool. Very cool. It's kind of, I don't want to say it's scary, but it's weird to think that you have that level of technology yeah. uh, guiding and directing people. I mean, I, I like the idea of being able to monitor your, like if you have children uh -huh, uh -huh, and they're not uh -huh. paying attention like they yeah, should. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I watch my girlfriend, she has a, a seven-year-old boy, uh -huh. and when they had video classes, he wouldn't pay attention. Yeah, I know, I know. And so I know. that solves the problem. Uh -huh. That solves the problem. That's good. All right, let's, let's check the next one out. Now, this is really cool, guys. I can tell you. I love technology. I'm not as up as I should be on it, but uh, coming to this has really inspired me. Uh, uh, is everybody's so welcoming here. Keep going. And this is about healthcare. Smart. Healthcare? Yeah. Smart healthcare? Yeah. Um, firstly, we should uh, Actually, hold on. our self information here, and then we can get a self ID. Uh, it's Your like name? a barcode. Okay. A self barcode, and we can do all the tests in this room to get our. Uh, your result of the your your body checking. So it can it can check all the functions of the body, the yeah, temperature, yeah, yeah, the yeah. heart rate, the pulse, and your function of your okay. organs. So it's kind of like a. This reminds me of if you've ever watched any, you know, futuristic space travel movie. This reminds me of a, the doctor's <laughs> lounge or the doctor's the doctor's room here that you would go into. Her head fell off. Oh no! It fell off. Oh my God. Okay, ma'am. Uh, apparently, according to the diagnostics here, your head is falling off. <laughs> All right, so she's. Oh. Footprint, so I'm going back. Stay back here. So I guess it's checking my body. Ah, my arms <laughs> falling. Works. My arms falling. Look at this. Oh my God. It's. I'm in bad shape, guys. I don't feel like the guy this looks. No, it's, it's good. <laughs>
That's me after. That's me after. That's me after. Oh, night. Is that my heart rate? No, it's the, the scores of your body. The situation. Okay. The max is 100, but your night is good. Does that mean? Uh, well, I mean, what does it mean? You are good. Good. Ah. Body shape. Oh, very good. Except this part. This is not. <laughs> Look at that. Maybe it's because you're too high. It probably is. That is funny. Here I'm doing a Parkinson's test, and if you look right here, I'm going to put my hand up and do this moving motion, and it's going to tell me whether I have Parkinson's or not. Or if you will have danger. Or the, the potential to get it, right? Is that good? Oh, normal. I'm normal. Hospitals aren't using this right now. Yeah, not right now. Okay. When do you think that they would use it? All right. When is it um, expected? Five to ten years. Five to ten years. Yeah. Okay. Right behind me is a 236-inch screen. It is by far the largest TV I've ever seen. This is an 8K TV, and not only is it 8K, it is super expensive. You said eight million. Rimnim B. Eight zero 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 zero. Eight million Rimnim B. It's not in production right now, but it will soon be in production. I'm, be, I'm, be, I'm being told. But this thing is freaking huge. Let me get stand back a little bit. Stay right there. Yeah. Just look at this. I could feel the heat from it. It actually would make a nice little heater too. So I'd get the kids playing some of their Xbox or their Sony PlayStation generate some heat you wouldn't have to turn on the heater and you'd have a lot of fun playing with this this is amazing it <clears throat> I got up close and did some videoing and it looks like you're standing in nature you can actually see some lines kind of through here but when you stand back a little bit you can't see the lines but the picture quality is just unbelievable this is remarkable <sighs> Maybe someday when I get rich and famous, I'll buy one of these. I feel like Matthew McConaughey in the movie Interstellar. Look at this, he's got all the bookcases flying by. If, you, if you've seen the movie, you gotta watch it. He does a little bit of time travel. All right, all right, all right, all right. I'm getting kind of nauseated. I'm gonna throw up in my Buick. It's like a, the depiction of some futuristic UN, United Nations. Look, there's Trump. I love the people of Saturn. I love the people of Saturn. Got, a, we got Bill Clinton down there. Hello. Hello, everybody. Hello, aliens.